Welcome to Torres News TV. Today's edition. Igbos don't deserve presidency in 2023. They will get VP slot. Chief Charles Sedehosa, the chieftain of the All Progressive Congress APC, has said the Igbos cannot achieve presidency in 2023 because there is no APC presence in any of the five states in the southeast. Speaking in an interview with the Daily Independent, the host has said the Igbos have themselves to blame by ignoring President Muhammad Bahari advice to vote for the APC in the last presidential election as to brighten their chances in 2023. The former political advisor to Comrade Adam Sachimole said he foresees a situation where the Igbos will vote massively for Atiku Abubakar, presidential candidate of the People's Pro uh, Democratic Party. The former political advisor to Comrade Adam Sachimole said he foresees a situation where the Igbos will vote massively for Atiku Abubakar, presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, in the 2019 general elections, if he decides to contest in 2023. Adehosa, who blamed the Igbos for abandoning the All Progressive Grand Alliance, the party founded by the late Dean Chukwemeka Odemei Wojuku, said the Igbos will get the vice president slot again in 2023. Forget the Igbos. They have shot themselves in the leg. It is a very funny demand. Why would anyone want to give Igbo's presence when there is no APC in the zone at all? The only party that could have given Igbo presidency is the APC. Buhari told them, but they decided to vote PDP. Now, from all indications, they would rather support Atiku for the presidency again because the vice president's position will still go the southeast. I see Atiku running again because the 2019 presidential election is the nearest article has come. So I don't think the Igbos deserve presidency because if they do, they ought to have planned properly. They let Emeka Ojubu give them Africa, but they threw it away. So under which party did they get presidency? He asked. And this is Terrence News TV. And um, we have all it takes today. Thank you for watching us.